breakfast. It's an egg and mushroom sandwich on wheat bread with a slice of cheese, my third glass of water, and my first cup of coffee. Lunch, um, chicken and gouda cheese sausage with a salad with strawberries and poppy seed dressing. So yummy. S smoothie made in my little ninja. So this is dinner, it's not plated up, but it is basically a vegetarian lasagna, but without noodles. I used a portobello mushroom cap, like big ones, sliced really thin, as my noodle layers. So it's like no pasta, just the layers. This entire container, which, like, let me put the lid down and show you, like this entire container. So it's a pretty, you know, it's a family size portion is 350 calories so I don't plan on eating this whole thing but like that's a really awesome deal you could split that into four and there you go move it cat Arr. all right guys hey guys um so food's been really good I've been wanting to eat the world but avoiding it, but food has been really good. Um, I don't have, somebody said, hey, you've been eating pretty good. Where's my, where's the way in? I am actually not getting on the scale this week at my house. That is due to an agreement that I am working with with somebody else, um, which is kind of a crazy thing for me. The scale's not really, not really a problem, but I do get on it a lot. So, uh, that's a little weird. And so there is not going to be a way in. But I think after that, I am going to do a um, way in every day for a while. Um, what was I going to say? Okay. I did. Oh, for people who are looking for um, Hair by Ash, Other Hair by Ash, her video, she is out of commission for a moment. She's fine. Don't panic. She's going to be lovely. My girl um, is just unavailable for videos. I am being her, the Ashley Army's ambassador, and I'm letting you all know she's fine and that she will be back with a vengeance. She just is going to be gone for a couple more days. There you go. Um, a dinosaur ate her, but he's going to spit her out in a week. So, I did this workout. It is the Weight Watchers Point Plus Fitness Workout Sampler. They sent it with Jennifer Cohen. They sent it to all their employees, and I have to say, um, this is what I think. On the DVD, there was, like, the... It was the entire, like, the entire workout, the 10-minute workout, and the express workout, which is 15 minutes. I don't know if it's all the exact same things that you get in the, wait, in, in the, in the package. I think the package is 50 bucks for five or 40 bucks for five DVDs. Let me talk to you about it. If you are not currently active, I think it's a fabulous beginner's video because even the express workout and stuff, she moves at a pretty, it's not quite slow, but it's not fast at all. The pace is very friendly. Um, so, and like her transitions from exercise to exercise are really doable, you're not feeling like you're behind or missing anything, so that's good. Learning curve on it, zero to none. You're going to be able to keep up with her at the end. Um, did I like the exercise? Okay, how about this? Was the exercise good? Now, I am somebody who runs often, who Zumbas often, and I consider myself um, pretty active and pretty fit. I don't get breathless easy. I can run five miles in an hour without breathing heavy or being exhausted. So that's to let you know where I'm at fitness wise. This, the DVD that was on here and the workouts that were on here, which are 
I don't think they're the full ones that are on the DVDs, so you're going to get even more of a workout. They were good. They work a lot of the same muscle groups as my hardcore Zumba, which is not just the Latin dance. It's actually like the um, a lot of squats and muscle building. <clears throat> that Zumba. This DVD works a lot of those same muscle groups. Squats. You know, um, and I was like, oh, I'll come abs, but without being on the ground and stuff, there is some weight lifting mixed in. I had my weights. I have two pound weights, three pound weights, and five pound weights. And I had them on a little table next to me so I didn't have to, like, get them off the floor and stuff. And it works really nicely. Um, I did get a burn in my arm. And... My BF is going through some stuff. Um, I did get a burn in my arms. I did not get a burn in my legs, but I do a lot of leg work, so I was not surprised there. But it was a good workout. Now, that's the workout quality. Was it fun? There was a time in my life I would have thought it was fabulous. I would have loved this series. The reason I don't is because my exercise has changed and my relationship with exercise has changed. I now like classes, like where other people's energy keeps you going and where the group makes it fun. Um, and for me, something like this DVD is funner in a class. So I would not like that. I like to get out of the house, to get into a group, and to work out that way. However, most of you guys are like, I won't do Zumba because I won't go out in front of people. And I don't want to, or, or I have no rhythm and I don't want to dance. Great workout. It really is a good workout. So, I'm not paid by Weight Watchers. I am paid by Weight Watchers, but only when I'm there. I am not paid to, like, sell their samples. I am not paid to push their products. They in no way were like make a video about this. They sent this to every employee uh, for us to be able to talk to the people who we see and who we counsel at the tables every day. Um, but but since I have a YouTube channel, I'm gonna go here and tell you guys that I really think that if you are not doing Zumba or something like that, one because of the expense of continuing classes, two because of the group, three because you have to leave your house, four because you don't like dance. This is a very good and very accurate, um, not accurate, a very good and very, what's the word, I like it, I think y'all should do it, I think that, I'm being distracted because my best friend is having a rough day and she keeps texting me, um, but I think that it's a good, it will get you a good workout, now, while we're talking about workouts, I have to say this, you get out of a workout what you put into a workout. So if you do, like, she she actually has two girls with her. One does the the easy and one does the hard. Um, if you only do the easy, you're still doing more than you normally would, but you're not really pushing yourself. So I would say if when you get it, you can only do 10 minutes at easy, you push till you can do 30 minutes, and then you start doing the hards. You push it till you can, you know, but you've got to build on it. Good. I like it, though. I was really surprised. I thought I was not going to like it at all. And it's boring because it's not Zumba, but I think the banana is going to love it. So I'm going to make her try it when she gets back in town, and I'm going to have her do a little review for you guys. Mm-hmm. That's what I have to say about that. Um, I got the banana's present. Finished painting. Painted today, um, which means that... I will be doing the New Year, New Me video tomorrow. I will be working on that. So, yay! All right. And also, I will be, while I am staying off the scale, I legally, working for Weight Watchers, have to weigh in by the 15th. So, I am going to go and weigh in somewhere on a Wednesday. And um, that... I will let you guys know how that goes. So, oh, maybe I won't. Maybe I'll just ask her to turn it in. I don't want to know my weight because I'm trying to stay away from the scale for a week, but we'll see. All right. 
I will talk to you guys tomorrow.